Hello everybody, I'm Bob Yerby from Remo Incorporated. I'm here to talk to you today about the new white suede heads. And uh, these heads will be available in Emperor and Ambassador weights. And the inspiration behind the white suede drum head was the, uh, was the smooth white head. And the beauty of the smooth white head is its beautiful mid-range. And um, the company that made us aware of this range this drum head produces is the Pearl Company. And Pearl, down in Japan, have been using these for years and, and um, you know, they're really behind it because they love the sound of it. And so, um, looking at the way that the head is manufactured from a technical aspect, is that you can see that the head basically is a texture, all right? So we call this textured sound technology. And what's important to understand about the white suede is that even though the head looks coated, it's not coated. It's a texture, okay? So by providing a texture to the smooth white, you get white suede. So if you look at the way that we've done it, we've textured the top of the drum head, and we've textured the bottom of the drum head. Now, to give you a more technical analysis of how we did this, I'll go ahead and cut this open for you to see. Well, I can just do it this way. You'll notice that the two inner plies are smooth white. So this creates more of a slippery type of surface on the two inner plies, which allows the drum head to vibrate freely on the two inner plies. Now, the contact points of the drum head being the bearing edge, which is going to sit on the inside of the collar, lands on a treated surface. The drumstick, on the other hand, will also be hitting a treated surface with the two inner plies being traditional smooth white. Okay? So that enables the drum head <coughs> and the drum sound to have those big mid range that smooth white produces, but it also has the clarity and the sustainability because of the slip on the inner two plies. Okay? So that is the technology behind white suede. The ambassador version will be a treated top and an untreated bottom. Okay, so the untreated bottom will be sitting on the bearing edge, the treated side will be sitting on the top. And this will produce uh, those same great warm tones and great feel, open sustain, that uh, we think drummers around the world are really going to enjoy. Thanks for listening.